Hi, I'm Michael Stanley and welcome to my farm here at Barham Bay. We've been here at Barham Bay for 18 months, nearly two years. Um, I moved to Ballarat uh, when I met my wife Jen and obviously we've got uh, two young kids now so we're happy to set up here in Ballarat or Burren Beat, a little suburb outside Ballarat and um, we're just progressing uh, our uh, improvements on the property as we go. I've, uh, unfortunately due to my injuries last year everything got set back and it's a uh, work in progress now instead of being finished but um, you know things come along really nicely and we're really happy and the horses seem uh, happy out here at the, the new facilities. In September last year, I had an accident uh, here at home on the track with one of the horses and, and broke my uh, leg in four places. Um, so that set us back quite a while. Um, obviously we were having a really good run till then and being laid up in, in bed, it put a lot of pressure on um, everyone around me, uh, particularly my wife, and to keep things going. And obviously uh, they were trying times for everyone, but um, you know, since uh, we've all been hands back on deck, um, you know, we, we look like we're heading in the right direction again. Currently have about 12 horses racing and, and things are going along really nicely now since the setback. It's taken a while to get back on our feet, but um, all the horses are, are really thriving and, um, you know, we're slowly picking up the pace again and getting the winners back on the track. Um, so, leading into the Vic Bread Super Series, um, it's really exciting that we've got the opportunity to take six runners for all our owners and hopefully uh, we can cap off a big one and um, get some reward for our hard times. Uh, this year um, we have two really exciting two-year-old fillies in Bentacular and Solo Angel. They've been really consistent all season. They've travelled up to an angle for the APG series where they both raced really good and winning their heats and semis and were both really unlucky in the final. So we have those two heading into the Vic Bread Super Series this weekend and after both performed really well in through the heats and the semi-finals, um, we're really looking forward to hopefully snaring a big one uh, with those two girls this Saturday night.